Hey guys, what's up? It's Haley and welcome back to my channel. So I went to a bunch of my local favorite thrift stores last week and I honestly picked up so many amazing stuff. And the best part is that I got everything for 50% off because there was a 50% off discount at Valley Village thrift stores and also at Salvation Army thrift stores. And I have so much stuff to show you guys. I am so crazy ecstatic. This is an entire haul of everything that I thrifted in the last week and I actually vlogged all of that. So be sure to go check that out. It's like a thrifting tips video. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So first I headed into the Salvation Army thrift stores. I picked up a lot of awesome stuff there. And this is actually the first thing that I got. It is this Roots top. It's kind of like a midi. It's very, very cropped. But this is one of those things that I would wear with high-waisted pants because I don't like showing too much tummy. But this will be really, really cute in the summertime. I love the colors. They're really giving me like Tommy Hilfiger vibes. And you could just tell by the logo, this is very like vintage Roots style. This will be such an awesome top for summer. And I'm pretty sure this one was $4. So the next item I got is just this like little crop t-shirt. This with like some nice old Levi's would look so adorable together. It's a very soft fabric too. It has like a little pocket here. And I just really like the stripes. I thought it was like a cute, unique style. So that would be really awesome for the summertime too. And then I went ahead and I went to the sweater section and I hit the gold with this. So this is the first thing that I picked up and it's just a Tommy Hilfiger sweater. Guys, I've been looking for a yellow sweater at the thrift store for the longest time and this one is a Tommy one. So that's even better. I love like the little discreet logo right there. So this looks really cute on. It's baggy but it's not too baggy so I actually think that I may crop it. Um, but I really love the color. It's great for all seasons, definitely. And this one was $7.99, so it was 50% off, which is even better. The color, the quality, everything is exactly what I was looking for, so I'm so lucky to have gotten that. And then I saw this, like, olive green one, which I really liked as well. I decided to get it because I really like the neck detailing, and I actually love that the fabric has these, like, ribbed texture going down the sweater, which I thought would be really nice, even if I did decide to crop it. And then I found another sweater. And I got so excited about this one because the color is everything. So it's actually a Polo Ralph Lauren sweater. I love, love, love blue so much. And this blue is like such a beautiful shade. This will be really cute, especially to crop because it's like so chunky and thick. And I just love like the little neck detailing here. And yeah, it has the baggy sleeves and everything. And these are all in such great condition. And the best thing about thrift stores is that you actually know that they've been washed. So you already know how these sweaters are going to settle. All three of them were larges. So that just goes to show guys, don't neglect big sizes and don't neglect small sizes depending on your body. After the men's sweater section, I headed to the women's blouse section and I found this beauty of a long sleeve. This is so cute. I love this. This is actually from Zara. It doesn't even feel like it's been worn at all. Stripes is definitely my thing. And these are beautiful neutral colors. I think it'll be so nice to both dress up and dress down. And then going off the fact that I love stripes and I love blue, I had to pick up this beauty. It looks really wrinkled on camera, but it's actually very good quality. It just needs to be ironed. And I just love this color. This is like a great basic that everybody needs to have in their closet. I definitely think so. And I just really like the fact that you can roll up this sleeves make it look really laid back and casual so I actually ended up getting two dresses from this thrift store the first one is like really simple but I thought it was really cute it is actually a forever 21 dress it's a really really great length and I really like these um crew neck dresses I think they're really flattering and I'm actually going to be going to LA in a couple of months so I want some easy pieces that I could just throw on and get out the door and then I actually got another dress which I am so 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 excited about because this is one of those things that like you go in the thrift store and you expect to find but you're lucky if you find one that's like in your size. Basically, this is it. It is like the coolest denim dress ever. Look at this, okay. The thing is, this one is like really, really long. So I'm gonna cut this to go to about my knee, maybe a little bit higher. And I think it'll look so cute. I love these buttons, ugh. And if you guys do wanna see a video on like how I crop and adjust these things, I will definitely make one for you. So let me know down below in the comments. And I found this like really awesome burnt orange um, coral dress and it's really long this is definitely a maxi but I actually am really into the style it's very baggy there's not much to it but you can style it in many different ways you can wear it with the belt I could just wear like a cute little jacket over it and make it into something very stylish but it gives me lots of like Zara vibes so I'm really into this and it was like a couple of bucks then I headed into my favorite section which is the men's jeans because men's jeans fit me 
perfectly. If they're like the smallest size, they're the perfect high-waisted mom jeans or like even regular jeans. And I found this pair, which is such a sick wash of ripped jeans. It is a size 28, which is the smallest size you can get in the men's. And every time I go to the men's section, that's usually the size I get because it fits my hips perfectly. And look at the rips. This is what I found so cool. It has like a ripped denim patch, but then under that it has like a darker denim, which I think is so cool. And it's pretty awesome because in the winter time, especially in Canada, you can't wear ribbed jeans. It is too cold for ribbed jeans. So these are a perfect solution for that. And then the second thing that I got was something I've been looking for for so long. For the longest time, I wanted like a sick pair of camel pants. So I got this pair and they are so cool, you guys. Like, oh, I love these. They're kind of faded and washed, but not because they're worn out. I think they're meant to look like that. They have like the sickest pockets right here. They have like this tapered side on both sides of the legs, which make it look really baggy, kind of give it like a really baggy style. I actually got so lucky also when it came to like the athletic department because I went to the thrift store looking for a lot of like tops that I can work out in because it is so hard to find good tops to work out in. And I got so lucky, look at what I found. This is like the perfect gym crop top that doesn't expose too much belly. And this one is perfect because it's long enough. And this cost $6.99, so it was $3.50, which is awesome. Like, this is so epic. I'm so happy about this. And then I actually found two more tops that I can wear to the gym. They're the exact same in two different colors. This is the first one. It's just like an Adidas top, and it has a really, really nice feel stretch to it. It is really good quality, and you can tell it is definitely something that will keep me cool while I'm at the gym. So I got that one in black, and then I got the same one in the navy blue. So I am so ecstatic about these because I've been looking for really good gym tops and these are amazing brands for that as well. So I always go by sections. Um, I started off at the short sleeve tops area and this is the top that I picked up. Again, it's a crew neck. I love this top and it's actually from Topshop. It is a size 4 which is perfect for me. I just honestly picked it up because I love the color. I feel like it is definitely a nice basic to have in the summertime and it will pretty much go with everything. And this is the t-shirt that I got. It's kind of like staticky right now, but it's really cute. It's just this like big oversized um, new t-shirt. And then the front right here says the year 2000, which I thought was really cute. And I just love that it's nude because you can always take a new top and pair it with anything and it will look great. Then I headed over to the men's sweatshirts and I found a couple good sweatshirts there. This is the first one and it is just this big cozy Levi shirt. You guys can see the Levi's logo right there. It is so soft, it's so cozy, and I just love this like washed out faded red look with jeans. Oh, this will look so good. Next sweater I picked up was a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I've been seeing a lot of people bring back these like bold, vibrant color sweaters. So I found this one and I thought that it was so cool. Like, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You could definitely tell that it's like an older style shirt, but I love it. I love the colors. I love the stripe white with the red, the accents, everything. I just think it is so cool. It is so vintage looking. It is actually a Nike top, which is awesome. So next thing I have to show you guys is from the jacket section, and I am so excited about this. Guys, I've been looking for this exact same jacket. I'm pretty sure I saw one at Urban Outfitters for like 90 something bucks. And this one is like exactly what I envisioned. It is so cute. It is such a great layering piece for when it gets a little bit warmer outside that I don't have to wear my big winter coat, but I still need something. I don't know the brand, but it is a medium and this costs $5 after the discount. So like, what an amazing deal, honestly. I love thrift store pants. They're always so cool looking and they just fit me so awesome because they're all really high-waisted. So this is the first one that I picked up. Um, it's just this like brown, feels like suede kind of pants, but it really looks cool. And the back has like some big pockets on the bum. I don't know if you could see it because it's really dark, but I really love these pants. They're like tailored really well. They have the little pleats right here and they're just a very easy way to class up any outfit. Then I got a second pair of pants, which honestly I think they're so cool. And this is them. They're very like thrift store looking. I just love, love, love these. And this is such a cool color for pants, I think. And my favorite part is just this like little detailed belt. I think it is the coolest thing ever. Wearing this with a bodysuit with these like tailored pants would look awesome. And if I see if it's not long enough, I may actually crop it, make it more of an ankle, maybe even distress the bottom a little bit. And I'm really excited to recreate them. And if you guys, again, do you want to see that, let me know. And I'll be sure to record like how I kind of DIY these into different looks. 
Next pair of pants are just really simple. It's just these ones. These are probably my favorite type of pants to wear in the summertime. And I just don't have one in this wash, which I really wanted. They're originally from Garage, which is like a Canadian store, I'm pretty sure. These are the kind of pants that you wear in the summer when you gotta wear like long pants, but you cannot be bothered to wear denim. So I love these. They're so flowy and obviously they need to be ironed and stuff. And then I'm sure they're going to be very wearable on an everyday basis. And the last pair of denim I picked up is actually a pair of Levi's. You guys know me. It's not a trip to the thrift store if I don't pick up myself a new pair of Levi's. So these are the ones that I got. They're actually pretty big. They fit my hips very well. They are a little bit loose up here, but if I add a belt, it's not a problem. And they are really big when it comes to the leg. And I'm definitely just going to turn them into a pair of bum ass shorts. Which honestly I've done before. I'm probably just going to crop them, make them into like a long pair of shorts. Distress it up, make it look really cool. And then I got myself some Levi shorts for how much? $5.99. So I got myself a pair of Levi shorts for $3. Instead of paying however much Levi's cost in the store now. So I'm really happy with these. Their wash is also beautiful. But I'm really happy to show you guys everything that I got. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Maybe you even got some like inspiration and ideas to go look in different places that you never thought to look before at the thrift store because I'm telling you guys, you can really, really, really get lucky as long as you're patient, as long as you're inspired, and as long as you're willing. If you do want to see me wear these outfits on an everyday basis, I do take a lot of pictures for Instagram, so be sure to follow me on there if you do want to see how I style them and turn them into like really cool outfits. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did because it honestly helps me out so much. If you guys do want to see me like DIY a lot of these and like show you how I turn things into shorts how I shorten dresses crop shirts and kind of like taper pants anything like that I would love to make an entire video dedicated to thrift store DIYs so be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and if I see that there's a lot of demand I will definitely make a video like that hey guys okay I have no idea what just happened I totally lost my outro I just wanted to say thank you all so much for watching again if you haven't subscribed already please do to join our family and I'll see you guys next time in another video Bye. I love it.